Hello, this is Dr. Leo at the lead time. My customer, Maria, she sent me an email a couple weeks ago and talked about her experience of buying the hydrosol products from Amazon before she purchased the KD5 hydrosol distiller. And she purchased two different hydrosols, lavender and chamomile. And what she found is the hydrosol, one problem is, uh, is a foamy. After shake, there's a bubbles. And the second one, the bad part is after spray on her face, she feel itchy. And that is uncomfortable experience. And smell very strong, like essential oil, but it has a yellowish color. And she asked me what happened. My understanding that's it's not a true hydrosol. The true hydrosol has no bubbles because you don't have any the foaming agent. When they try to make or disperse the essential oil into the water or even just artificial fragrance into the water, they need a solubizer uh, agent. It's like a detergent to uh, mix the oil with water. So that causes the foamy and also the color Pure hydrosol or fresh made hydrosol has clear color or just a bit of a milky because small amount of uh, essential oil dispersed in it. And the second, you don't feel uncomfortable when you use the hydrosol even directly, especially like lavender, chamomile. And the third is you don't have that sharp or strong smell from the pure hydrosol. In this video, I will talk about top three uses of a pure hydrosol. Some of them you may know and some of them you may not. Let's talk about it. The first group of use is uh, skincare. That's maybe a lot of people use hydrosol for. Um, the benefits of using the hydrosol including moisturizer, hydration, anti-aging, antioxidant, anti-inflammation. And there are many different uh, hydrosols made from uh, different herbs, uh, lavender, witch hazel, chamomile. They all have their own preference because they are different the chemical composition. If you have a dry skin, you want to use the rose water. It can be mixed with other herbs. But rose water is a very benefit to keep our skin hydrated. And also it's uh, anti-aging because it contains antioxidants. For oily skin, witch hazel is a good candidate because it can control the, uh, secretion or sebum and also keep the skin healthy because of its antimicrobial. Uh, Geranium is also a good option for oil skin. And also witch hazel has benefits to reduce the redness. It can be used after the sunburn or reduce the inflammation on the skin. And you can also use the hydrosol as a hairspray to help keep the scalp clean, healthy, and uh, keep our the, the hair more strong. The second group use of hydrosol is uh, air spray. Like aromatherapy, essential oil is commonly used with drops into the water within a diffuser. But with time, just, uh, the smell will uh, fade it away because essential oil will be vaporized first. They are floating on top of the water. So the rest will become just a pure water. It's like a humidifier. By using the hydrosol, it can keep your smell constant for the, all the time when the hydrosol is stay into the, your diffuser. So you can use a lavender hydrosol to put in the diffuser and then it can keep your smell all the time. Besides working as an air freshener, and you can use the hydrosol like a eucalyptus. Um, you can put it into a diffuser or in the spray bottle and spray around it. 
and this can give a benefits to your respiratory system because it gives you the benefits when you smell, breathe in the eucalyptus and help clean the lung and the uh, respiratory system. And the third group or the last group I want to talk today, the uses of hydrosol is food additive. Adding a teaspoon of uh, cinnamon hydrosol into a hot cup of uh, coffee, this can boost its uh, delicious smell of the coffee. If you love cinnamon, this is the best way to make in a hot drink. Um, because the hydrosol has no color, and this will not ruin the original food color, but it has a strong flavor extracted uh, so from the herb, so it gives the benefits. The second way I recommend you to try is make a hydrosol ice cubes and use the ice cube to make your special flavored uh, drink from a juice to cocktail. So make that, it's like a mystery taste coming from the ice cubes. In the same way, spray the hydrosol onto your the salad or the dishes so it can add this mystery flavor into the food and also give you the benefits of the extraction from the herb. So I only talk about the top three uses of a hydrosol and there are also tens of other uses so you can keep exploring but one of the key things for all of the uses is use a uh, authentic hydrosol, pure hydrosol. Don't use any hydrosol that come from uh, mixing the essential oil with water or any other artificial way because for any other ways, they have to add in some uh, um, detergent or solubilizer can help stabilize those, the smell into the water. It's not a real. So use the KD5 hydrosol distiller to make your pure hydrosol from any herbs. Thank you for watching. Please leave your comments and questions down below. And this is Dr. Leo at Lee Time. See you next time.